The Panzer, Western reporting name SA-22 Greyhound, is a short-range air defense system. It was designed to protect strategic military and civil point targets. It was originally designed to meet requirements of Russian Air Defense Forces, PVO. This system is capable of engaging a wide variety of aerial targets, such as aircraft, helicopters, ballistic and cruise missiles, guided bombs and UAVs. Developers claim that it is also capable of engaging stealthy aircraft, such as the F-22 and F-35. It was first publicly revealed in 1995. United Arab Emirates was the first customer of this system. Their order was made back in 2000. The system was trialed in 2006. Deliveries to the United Arab Emirates began in 2007. The Panzer S-1 is a version of this system, intended for Russian military. The first 10 Panzer S-1 air defense systems were delivered to the Russian Air Force in 2010. It was officially adopted in 2012. It is claimed that by 2014 more than 200 of these air defense systems were produced. In 2017 Russia operated 110 Panzer S-1 and newer S-2 systems while more units were scheduled to be delivered. It has also been exported to Algeria, 104 units in various versions, Iraq, 24 units, Oman, up to 12 units, Syria, up to 40 units, and United Arab Emirates, 50 units, and possibly Vietnam. This air defense system was recently ordered by Equatorial Guinea, 2 units, and Jordan, 5070. The Panzer saw action during the military conflict in Ukraine and Syria. In 2018 at least one Syrian Panzer system was destroyed by an Israeli airstrike. The Panzer is a further development of the 2S6 Tunguska air defense gun-slash-missile system, based on a tracked chassis. It carries up to 12 surface-to-air missiles in sealed containers. These missiles are ready to launch and have a radio command guidance. The missiles have no seekers. Instead tracking is provided via the launcher vehicle sensor system. However unlike the Tunguska, the Panzer is more of a stationary system, designed to protect point targets. The 57 times 10 to the power of 6 missile of the Panzer has a two-stage solid-fuel rocket motors. It has a maximum speed of 1,000 meters per second, Mach 3. Missiles of this air defense system have a maximum range of 20 kilometers, minimal range is 1 kilometer, maximum altitude is 8 kilometers. The Panzer also has two dual 30 mm guns, similar to those of the Tunguska. These are derivatives of aircraft cannons. Combined rate of fire of these guns is up to 5,000 rounds per minute. These can engage targets up to 4 kilometers away. A total of 1 400 rounds are carried for these guns. This air defense system can fire its missiles on the move, however cannons can be fired only when the vehicle is stationary and jacked on four hydraulic jacks. Probability of defeating a single target is around 60 to 80 percent, depending on the target type and firing conditions. The Panzer also has a limited capability against ground targets and is capable of firing armor-piercing projectiles. Though this capability is mainly intended for self-defense, as the Panzer is generally unarmored and would be extremely vulnerable on the battlefield. The Panzer has a multiple band target acquisition and tracking system. It detects targets at a range of 30 kilometers and has a tracking range of over 24 kilometers. Also there are thermal imaging system and optical tracker. This air defense system can engage two targets simultaneously and is capable of engaging up to 12 targets within one minute. Developers claim that this system has a high jamming resistance. Some Russian experts report that operational use of this air defense system in Syria revealed that the baseline Panzer S-1 struggles to detect small and slow-moving targets, such as small UAVs. In one particular case, the Panzer S-1 expended 13 of its missiles in order to defeat only three hostile UAVs. The Panzer air defense system has a reaction time of only 5 to 6 seconds. It takes three minutes to engage a target from traveling. Vehicle is operated by a crew of three, including commander, operator, and driver. The Panzer S-1 air defense system that was adopted by the Russian Air Force is based on a Kamaz 6568 by 8 military truck chassis. Vehicle is powered by a turbocharged diesel engine, developing 400 horsepower. It has a full-time all-wheel drive and is fitted with a central tire inflation system. 
First prototype of this air defense system was based on Euro 5323 8x8 truck chassis. Other wheel chassis were trialed or offered with this system, including Kamazi 6350, and ZKD 7930, the AZ 6909 and MAN-SX 8x8 truck chassis. The MAN-SX chassis is used by United Arab Emirates. It is also offered with a track GM 532 series chassis of the Tunguska or BMP-3 infantry fighting vehicle chassis. Furthermore it can be deployed in a stationary module or on naval vessels, depending on customer requirements. Each Panzer combat vehicle can operate as a standalone mode, without any external support. Up to three to five combat vehicles can be used in a battery, where one of the vehicles operates as a command post and sends target data to other vehicles. These combat vehicles can also operate in conjunction with a separate air defense command post and early warning radar. There is a number of associated support vehicles, such as reloading vehicle, electronic and mechanical maintenance vehicles, mobile workshop and mobile trainer. 